Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your January 2019 general reading. So it's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Virgo who um, views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Happy New Year, okay? Um, what else can we say? Let's get started. I have shuffled and prayed over the cards. Uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, Virgo, okay? Right. So, we're going to start with love first, and then we'll jump into career. Eight of air at the bottom of the deck. Or eight of swords. Okay. Let's see what's going on here for love for Virgo. Okay. Coming up in your own reading. The Hermit. Nine of fire. King of fire. The lover's card. So this is a, a situation where... Virgo has a lot of desire to you're in separation with someone you're contemplating either reaching out to them or you have uh, contacted them in some manner I don't feel like it's been successful if you have not contacted someone or someone hasn't contacted you they, they are contemplating it uh, you guys are in separation trying to determine if you want to jump back into what used to be a very fast paced relationship very passionate very um free form i don't even, i can't even say it's, it was really committed for some of you it could have been a commitment but this is what you desire to do this is what you want to do um, you, Virgo, you or the person you're dealing with, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, could already be committed. Uh, whether that's marriage or just, you know, boyfriend, girlfriend, long-term commitment. There's already someone separated from a particular person. It might have been a third-party situation with the lovers here. And now they're contemplating coming back. Eight of Swords. You think of this person a lot. You think of this situation a lot. It swirls in your head. It's it's repeating. It's it's over and over. Or vice versa. This is how they think of you. It's not all good thoughts either. But they are thoughts of the other person or or maybe persons. The choice to you know you have to make a choice what you desire and then what you're obligated to you also feel a very strong connection with this person um, you may even subscribe to the whole twin flame soulmate type of situation um, could very well be that this this is a union that is blessed on some level you were brought together either soulmate to teach you each other something or you you are meant to be together it's just one of those two different one of those two some of you you are already partnered, but you think about going back to this person, maybe because of sexual um, reasons. The the passion that was there, you think of that. This is a choice in lovers 
who or what will you choose? You're definitely in heavy contemplation. Think about what you've done in the past, the hermit card, and where it's gotten you. Okay. Um, what's the advice for Virgo and love? Okay. Four of air. All right, those two cards fell out. Let's see, I'll pick these up. All right. This kept falling out off camera for you. Ace of water, the hierophant. Under the deck, the four of earth. And then the four of fire. I have to take it. So you get four, four, four. That may mean something for someone. Okay. Bottom of the deck, the three of air or the three of sword. So. It looks like Virgo knows that this is a situation where they're in separation, trying to heal maybe from divorce or separation, maybe due to infidelity, but very much still thinking about this person or this situation. Virgo could be partnered to Taurus, Libra. Virgo feels like this connection with another person is very spiritual. They know that the choice of lovers governs all aspects of um, Stability. Fours are about stability. What they've created thus far. They want the relationship that they may be in. Virgo wants a person that they're in separation with. They have energetically, physically, in thought, in thought, held on to the relationship, the passion that they have with this person. All while being obligated to to someone else, but very much in love with another. Virgo understands that this situation may end in divorce or separation, maybe from an, a person that they have obligation to. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, or a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. We've got Gemini on the board, and Taurus or Libra. Virgo, like yourself. So the advice is do what's best for your own stability. You can create your own, take charge to 444 is about taking leadership ownership in charge of a situation get in front of because you're in separation from someone who you really want to be with there's passion and love for this person let me see yeah might be that Virgo needs to they have it's fear surrounding leaving a marriage is toxic it's codependency it's fear of the of the worst but the son is here God says I'm here to help um, sheds positivity and light on a situation to where maybe you can offer Messenger of Earth. Virgo has been wanting to to stabilize or to come together with someone for a very long time. It could be a Virgo like yourself, Gemini, Taurus, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, 
Aries, Sagittarius, everybody's here, okay? Yeah, wow. Yeah. Um, there's change on the horizon for you, Virgo. Um, you thought you could move away from the Five of Swords, but the Five of Swords talks about past issue also cropping back up to where the heavy arguing, the verbal abuse, or, or, um, the, the ego based arguments happen where you just want to win we just want to dig deep with a particular person about a particular situation or a particular person right um the five of earth says you, you don't have any there's lack of confidence lack of forward movement lack a lack mentality here in regards to maybe this this is love love situation you want to reconcile or someone wants to reconcile with you or for maybe um, messages even a gift or an apology and reignite uh, the passion the desire some of you are having synchronized events dreams come to you in regards to um wow we got five 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 here also um in regards to what you need to do and how you're hesitating before making a decision but spirit keeps speaking to you through event through through dream um definitely through event about what it is Virgo needs to do to gain control of the situation that they are hesitating before making a decision a mourning a, a mourning uh, loss before you actually have suffered the loss okay all right so Virgo that's where you guys are um, in love let's see what career has to offer Virgo thank you thank you thank you okay you got the blessing Virgo knight of pentacle messages eight of wands nice no nice 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 Four of Swords. Mm-hmm. Ace of Pentacle. Ace of One. Wow. Um. So for my Virgo, there is um, money definitely coming in. The need to make or keep plans secret. Some of you may be walking away from partnerships. Maybe those that don't serve you anymore or needing to gain control by way of making a plan of action um revising or devising a plan of action in secret because you are going to separate separate and gain stability maybe even a new start two new starts wow the nine of pentacles Three of Swords here also definitely separating from uh, some of you waiting for money, waiting for an offer. Maybe this is like waiting for a job offer. The, the communication comes in 
or waiting for communication about the sale of you fill in the blank doing all of this in secret because you're making plans to have what it is you want in regards to maybe separation and or divorce that start something new new business uh, engagement moving in together taking a situation a relationship to the next step new job um, being restless in your current position because of a business opportunity being on fire and passionate about putting the energy effort time into maybe a business opportunity and or some of you are just waiting for money in regards to uh, divorcing a situation or a person so that's it um let's see let's put this up let's get some angel answers in here uh money looks good very good I don't think you have much to worry about there for uh, Virgo because money looks great um, in career. So if you're waiting for a job or money or to sell a property to sell of anything, it's coming. All right, what just flipped out is you're ready. Oh, so now <laughs> you guys are just flipping out all of them. Trust. Communicate clearly. Look for a sign. We we saw that in love message. There are like so many signs coming in for you in regards to you maybe taking action with um, or action on a particular situation. What do you have it's about? Listen to your intuition. Beautiful messages. And I will clarify, communicate clearly. What is it that Virgo should communicate clearly? These cards have reversals in them, so I'm try to Communicate clearly. Some of you need to have the strength to move something forward in regards to um, career and finance. Knight of Pentacles again, Five of Swords in reverse. Wow, you need to communicate clearly that you really want to offer something. You want to stabilize or you want to. Yeah, you want to make something solid stable with someone you want to maybe an air sign you want to come out of confusion out of change out of heavy arguing five of swords in reverse um out of past issue you want them to get over it because you want to stabilize this you're ready nine of pentacles in reverse all right Not the cards you want in reverse, but still a good card. Just says it's maybe you are okay. You're ready. You're ready to come out of that whole independent single type of mindset. You've done the Nine of Pentacles upright long enough. I am woman, hear me roar, I can take care of myself, or I'm a, I'm a man, I don't need a woman, I could, you, you need to come out of that mindset or, or give on that just a bit, because you're ready for partnership, or you're ready to come to the culmination of maybe, um, a family dynamic, ready to go ahead and make it really solid and stable, and you're ready to come out of that. I'm acting as if you're single and you're, and you're very much partnered. Hmm. Okay. Listen to your intuition. Oh, jeez. Alright. This is way... You know what? I'll just go with it. King of Cups. Ace of Cups in reverse. 
Seven of Swords, Upright, Judgment, Hierophant, or the Hanging Man in Reverse. Listen to your intuition, Virgo. You're very much, or someone's very much in love with you. But you guys are not seeing eye to eye. Or the new start hasn't manifested. But it's here for the taking. Um, in the partnership that you're in. There's... You're not happy. You, you're trying to gain control by way of thinking about going back and taking stock of and making a plan of action, sneaking away from partnership so that you could possibly have a second chance, a second go round, an opportunity to offer an apology to. Your intuition tells you to come out of the hangman sta stage where you're doing nothing. But it tells you, it looks like it, it's telling you to take action with the Seven of Swords here. Okay. Bottom of the deck, death in reverse. Something's not over. All right, so Virgo, if this message resonated for you, um, thank you for tuning in. It means a lot. Um, Happy New Year. Take care, guys.